Merry Christmas, everybody, and welcome back to another Pirates Chess video. And welcome to day two of the Chess Miss Special, where I do 12 days of gambits. So the first day we had the uh, King's Briar Gambit, and today we're hoping for some other fun gambits. So let's get our going. 15 minute standard rated 8 to 1200, no increment. Let's go. Uh, great game. All right. If you have any comments, make sure to leave them in the comment section below. And if you like my videos, hit that subscribe button because they're coming out daily. And of course, follow me on Instagram and Twitter where you will get to know a little bit more about me and quicker updates on the videos that go to YouTube. Unless you're a subscriber, then you get instant updates. Mm, black. So is he going to do E4? E4. Oh wow, he did um He did D D D4. What's a gambit against D4, man? I don't know. Oh uh, I don't know if this is a gambit, but we're gonna do it. D five. I feel like anything where you're just throwing a pawn out there is a gambit at some point in time. Oh, this is interesting. Alright, I know this this is um let's do it. Let's do it this way. This has got to be a gambit. I don't know what kind of gambit. <laughs> this is going to be weird. Is he going to take with his queen? Oh, he doesn't. No way. Um, if I do this, he can't, he can't give me a check on my king. This is interesting. I also defend my center pawn. <laughs> Interesting. Um, what should I do? Oh Lord of Lord. Let's um let's do this. This this uh unpins the uh, the pawn from my queen. Okay. Um And then we could do something like uh, this and attack his queen. He's got to be careful because he can't really just sidestep it. He's got to move like all the way over or back. Wow. Really, eh? Hey? Interesting. Very, very interesting. So, I don't really want to um, trade queens right away. So what if we do that? Everything is defended. Okay. And then... Um, if I do that, might work, maybe. Um, we can do, uh, oh, well, um, no, I don't want to do that. Okay. Uh, we're going to push, we're going to, we're going to do this. I can't move my A-pawn, uh, because it's, his bishop and his queen will yeah, be good. Oh, but you know what? He can take, um, oh. we can go like, why did he move his king there? To defend his bishop? weird hmm. hmm what do I want to do what do I want to do takes 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 
maybe because I feel like if I do this he'll just um he'll just take okay we'll do this this defense at least that pawn so he can't do anything at least that's protected This is weird. <laughs> this is a weird, uh, weird gambit that happened. I don't know. It's a weird position. Um, I want to move. I want to uh, Fanchetto my my f8 uh, bishop. Interesting. So he wants a trade of the queens again. It's all about those trades, eh? All about them trades. But nothing is. Nothing is under attack. Well, like, he could take my pawn, but then I would just take his queen with my king. And I think I'm fine with that. So let's do something like. Where's the best spot to go here? We'll just move over. Oh, wow, my opponent left the game. Interesting. All right, claim victory. I guess he thought I was going to take his queen or something. Weird. So, new game. Let's go for it. Two games. Two games this video. Or maybe he left because I was taking so long. Who knows? <laughs> I was taking a while to think just because it was like some weird positions. Um, like he's... Weird positions, I guess you just kind of go for like standard development. I don't know. White. Ooh. Um, Danish Gambit, right? Boom. Uh, how do I do the Danish Gambit again? Let's just. Yeah, okay. But it's like, it's so hard, man, because no one ever wants to do what I want to do when I'm doing. When I am doing. Doing it, doing it, doing it. See? No one ever does it. No one ever does it. Uh, maybe I'll just take. Should I just take for the for the hell of it? Um, it it might not be a Danish gambit, but it's probably another kind of gambit. I don't know. Um, or it's a like defend. Takes takes offers trades of queens, or we just push up. We'll just push up. <laughs> hmm. So what are we doing? Whoa, what is he doing? He wants to attack my uh Is he alpha? I'm not Man, like four four moves in. If you're asking for a take back, it's just not happening. <laughs> it's just not happening. I mean, I guess like he thinks that I'm gonna take with my bishop, but then he takes with his queen, and that's not good for me. At least not that I, I don't want it to be. It's not that good. Uh, yeah. So we're gonna do this. Actually, I shouldn't pre-move. Every time I pre-move it, um, they always do something <laughs> that <laughs> makes my pre-move like the worst possible move ever. So now I can do something like uh, this, and then uh, take the pawn with my bishop now, pinning his knight to his queen. And his knight has no defender. So that, I think, is a good move. Oh no! Damn you! Yeah, I think you saw what I wanted to do.
take with the bishop, he takes with his bishop, I take with the knight. Or take with the knight, take with the bishop, take with the bishop. That's probably a better way to go. I wonder if he'll take my pawn, thinking that I will take, yeah. So now, hmm. Takes, and then he takes with his knight, and that leaves my um, knight hanging. But we could uh, maybe do something like this. Take the free pawn. That was a bad move, uh, moving the rook out. Because uh, he's going for the G, the 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 G pawn, I guess, right? But it's not really hanging. It actually allows me to develop my bishop. I'm going to take his bishop if he doesn't take mine. I think that is the next plan of action. He might even uh, take my knight with his knight. Oh, actually. Actually. Um, I have no idea what he's going to do. But there is this, which gives a check. And then takes the bishop. Right? Did he even... He took my pawn. But there is this. Which I guess is... Oh, wow. He didn't even... Wow. Oh. <laughs> it was just... Um, We'll do this. Now he can't take my knight. Unless he takes with the pawn. Go to defend my knight. No, it doesn't look like it, eh? That's unfortunate. That definitely did not work how I uh, how I thought it was gonna go. Um. It's kind of like I have to. Uh, yeah, because it's all defended. It's all defended. So we'll just we'll just take the pawn. I wonder maybe he'll push his pawn down. He should take my knight with the king, I think. That seems logical. I could check him. Really? Really? I don't want to lose my knight. 
Both my bishops are just kind of like chilling way back here. I definitely got to get him out. Um, if he goes back, maybe I'll bring the... Wow, he went forward? Man. Man, oh man. Can I do anything? Hmm, I want to take that rook. What to do? I'm honestly, I'm, I'm kind of surprised that he hasn't. Uh... We'll do this. Because I'll move my knight. And uh, that'll throw him a check. Look at this. I want to put my knight somewhere that. Um, okay. But let's think about this. Let's give her a little think seat. Check. Oh, and he can't take. So he has to move his king. His bishop down there does it. Oh no, I guess he can take with his bishop. We'll do this first. It's always the bishop. Always. Interesting. And check. Check. I gotta be super like <laughs> trying to be super sneaky. Oh man, this guy is just uh, he's getting it. Oh man, this dude is so annoying. Mother. Uh, he's gonna get my knight. Can I check this way? Oh, fuck my, ah, my queen. Oh, no, wow, he totally, uh, crazy. He missed it. I got so lucky, so lucky. And my opponent left the game. Oh my god, I cannot believe my luck. Wow. And he left the game. Um, I think he left the game because no matter where he goes, it's checkmate, right? Yeah. Um, yeah, because the only place he can move is g4 and then I give him a check with my bishop and that is mate I don't think you can go anywhere else yeah that's yeah that's crazy but he 100% in this position um yeah his bishop <laughs> his bishop that's been chilling on b Eight since the beginning um, that would have been the best move bishop takes queen oh and I didn't even see that I think there was one back here too that I'm 
so that was definitely not the right move. Um, a better move would have been queen to f, um, queen to f3. That probably would have been a better move. He's yeah, he's good with the the whole, the moving his king around, like having an active king. Like he was not doing what I was hoping he would do and leaving uh, leaving pieces hanging. He played that pretty solid. Um, yeah, and it was it was basically like I had I I kind of had to do this because uh, it's that or like I move my queen. And it's still like I can move my queen to uh, to f3 defending the knight, but it doesn't give him a check. And then he would probably just like push his pawn down, attacking my queen, which would also be defended. And yeah, it's just um, kind of an awful position. Yeah, he played that. He played that well. It's unfortunate. He probably saw that he did the wrong move, and then was like, "That's it. Crazy." Alright guys, if you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button and make sure to check out my next videos because they are coming out daily. And I will see you later. Cheers.